Hi everyone, this is David with David's Tutorials and in today's video I'm going to show you two quick ways to temporarily declutter your desktop in Windows 10. If you're like me and you wind up doing a lot of stuff on your computer, you may sometimes get frustrated with all the stuff you need to keep open on your desktop all at the same time. Sure, you could close these things or even minimize them to the taskbar, but my goodness, you need all that stuff, right? And you're going to come back to it real soon now, aren't you? If this is you, not to worry. Here are two quick things you can do to temporarily clear off your desktop and make it nice and decluttered and then bring it back to where it was when you're done. The first thing you need to do is to get rid of all those open windows except the one that you're working on. The fastest way to do this is to simply use your mouse cursor to grab the title bar of the window you're working on and shake it side to side. This will make all of the open windows except the one you're working on disappear and minimize to the taskbar. That gives you a very nice decluttered desktop to work on. See? Works like a charm. To bring the desktop back to where it was, simply grab that title bar one more time, shake it side to side again, and all of the windows are open back to where they were before. Easy, right? The second tip is to temporarily hide all of the icons you have on your desktop. If you're working in Windows 10, having come over from Windows 7 or some earlier version of Windows, you may have a whole bunch of icons on your desktop. If that's the case, this is for you. All you have to do is right click on an open area of the desktop. It doesn't matter if you have windows open, simply find an open area and right click. In the context menu that appears, click on view and then uncheck show desktop icons. There they go. All of the icons are gone and you have an absolutely clean desktop, which is something you might want to do, especially if you're doing screencast recordings such as things to post up on YouTube. To bring the icons back, simply right click on the desktop, click view and check show desktop icons. And there they are. I hope these two tips make your workflow easier and less cluttered. If you have other tips or if you have comments on these tips, leave us a comment in the comment section down below. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button to let the YouTube robots know that you thought this video was a helpful video. And if you are already a subscriber, thank you so very much. If you're not a subscriber, why not go ahead right now and click that subscribe button. If you'll also click the bell icon, then YouTube will let you know the next time we post another great tutorial right here on David's Tutorials.